School Crossing Guards in Mobile have a new tool to help keep students and them safe. They call it the pickle. Although it doesn't exactly look like a pickle, WKRG News 5's Akivia McFarland shows you how it works. When it comes to directing school traffic, this is what most are used to seeing. But this school year, you may notice something different in some school zones in Mobile County. This is the pickle. It's a white device with a button on top, one click, she changes the traffic pattern. Now it may not look like much, but the pickle actually controls the lights here at the intersection of Spring Hill Avenue and Tuthill Lane, right here at St. Ignatius Catholic School. It allows the crossing guard to direct traffic without being in the busy road. Michelle Davis has been a community resource officer with Mobile Police since 2016 and knows the potential dangers of being a crossing guard. I've had near incidents where cars almost hit me. It was terrifying for the most part, but get over it. And get right back to the job of keeping pedestrians safe. But for Amanda Lutman, keeping her CROs safe and comfortable is just as important. It's hard work being out here. It's 80 degrees at 5 a.m. She's able to stand in the shade. She still has her head on the swivel. She's still in charge of her school traffic. Um, it just lets her be a little bit more present without um, being exhausted by the end of her, her traffic assignment. Drivers can expect to see the pickle in use at busy intersections near schools like ER Dixon, BC Rain, and Causey Middle. And like most new things, it's going to take some getting used to. Still getting used to it, and I think the parents are too. I think they're getting used to me being on the side now. I think they, they're finally realizing that she's controlling the light, which is a whole lot safer. Drivers are also reminded to do their part in keeping school zones safe by staying off their phones, adhering to speed limits, and paying attention. And if you don't... Oh, I'm going to blow my whistle. <laughs> I'm going to blow my whistle. Reporting in Mobile, Akivia McFarland, WKRG News 5.